fight, the fight You did it in a fight last time Motherfucker, you're addicted to your life You gotta fight Alright, coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown You know, we trot out the term well-rounded in modern-day mixed martial arts, maybe more than we should, but this guy fits the bill. Maybe doesn't stand out in any one area on film, but plus skills everywhere. And you gotta think tonight, Joe, with his skill set, he's more than comfortable really anywhere this fight goes. If he needs to stand and strike, he can do it. If the fight hits the canvas, he can submit you. A lot of different skills brought to the table by this young man. This guy is a very well-rounded fighter. He can do it all. If the fight takes place standing or on the ground, he's gonna be comfortable in all areas of the game. With self-belief for days, here is the notorious Conor McGregor, simultaneous two-division champion in the UFC. Nobody has done that before. Probably the best left hand in the game, whether you're a featherweight or a welterweight, you do not want to get hit with that left from the notorious Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. More than five years apart, with big differences in height and reach. We set it inside the octagon, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Lade. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet six inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Lisbon, Portugal, he's on. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor! Okay, protect yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now and go back to your corner. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long ready? time. And it is going to go down fight. right now. Here we go. Pretty good jab there, Joe. And the left hand behind it. Head kick attempt, but the fighter got the right hand up. McGregor gets caught with that punch. Joe, pretty good head movement to slip that right hand. He clipped him with that one. Oh! Oh, lands that punch. Just out of range with that right hook. Good 
McGregor gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Huge block there. Lands a powerful kick. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there, and he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow oh, he him got to clipped there. Down. He got hurt. He's got hurt here. the punch. Head kick! And he's looking for that left. Right hand upstairs. And he's looking for that left hand. Just missed. Two minutes to go in the round. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. That one hurt. Here comes the kick, that one blocked by McGregor. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, he tagged him! Can he hang on? Nice oh. Hard left hook. Under a minute to go. Back to the overhand left, no good. Look at that nasty jab. Oh, the roundhouse kick lands. He clips him again. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by McGregor. There's that jab. Final seconds of round one. Good shot. Round two straight ahead. Let's take a look at some of the action in that round here. And here's a nice punch that lands clean. And here's another punch that sneaks through. And here's another perfectly placed punch. Brittany Palmer doing fine work as usual. You ready? You ready? Round two here. Starting off this round, you gotta think he's probably still hurt from that last round. He's gonna wanna move and avoid taking damage early. about that shin. Leg kick is there. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. Kick to the body by McGregor. Good punch. Block, Joe. There's a hard leg kick by Connor. Hit him with the jab. Back and forth we go here. Oh, right hand is there for him, Joe. Nice kick landed there by Connor. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Look at that jab, nice. McGregor gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. The 
the jab followed by the right hand. Nasty combination. Oh, straight right. 90 seconds to go in round two. Conor McGregor with some body shots. Oh, absolutely, Joe. Devastating shots to the body. He avoids the clinch. seconds to go. McGregor gets caught with that punch. And that's how you defend the double leg, ladies and gentlemen. He's got a guillotine. One on guillotine here. All right, that's the end of round number two. Here's a huge punch to the head that stuns his opponent. And here we see another huge punch that stuns his opponent. And here is one more massive punch he lands that really stuns. What a brawl that round was. Ariane Celeste in the building. is there with the left. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Wow! Big body, body shot. shot there, too. In half guard position. Just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw off that. Stay and busy here. You like to see that, Joe. Nice combination from the half guard here. Big shot from the bottom. Well, you got to be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. He's got side control. Throws the right hand there. He's back to his feet, but he's hurt. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. with the left there. How about that shin? Under one minute remains in round three. Oh, McGregor's uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there. It closed quickly. And again, Joe, he's showing a vulnerability to that jab, leaning right into his opponent's striking range and leaving his head wide open to absorb damage. Oh, right up. He's in trouble, he's in trouble. She tagged him again. Ten seconds to go here, let's see what happens. Massive right hand. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. And here a big 
shot lands and a knockdown. And here another big shot lands and another knockdown. And here another clean shot lands and another knockdown. What an action-packed round. It looked like it almost ended on multiple occasions. Thank you very much, Ariane. Celeste is here. All right, here's round four. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Caught him with a punch. Oh, a huge block there. Clipped him with the jab. And he lands a knee. He's got a beautiful leg kick. than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Check it out here. Right on the button. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near-perfect execution and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. Here we go inside the Octagon Ladies for the official decision to Bruce Buff. Buff. Stop for this contest. At two minutes, 20 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by... Jesus! So there he is, the man of the moment. Certainly maximized the showcase here tonight. Joey gets a big win by way of the knockout. Certainly kept the judges out of it here tonight. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there will be no wiping the smile off of his face tonight. He will party deep into the night with his friends, his family. A huge knockout turned in by that man here tonight. And he has set himself up for a huge fight now, moving forward inside the octagon.